hello guys this is your boy psycho Rai. thank you for stopping by and if you're new to this channel a big warm welcome to my channel we took a train from la spezia to rio maggiore from rio maggiore to manarola is just 1.1 kilometer the easiest path along the trail and also known as via della more way of love it is a powered path along the coast offering a panoramic view the cinque terre hiking can be divided into two main trail the sentiero rosso the red trail and sentiero azzurro the blue trail i and my friends chose sentiero azzurro among all the cinque terre my favorite one is manarola the buildings are so beautiful it's colorful and it's just so gorgeous so guys leave a comment below let me know which one do you prefer From Manarola to Corniglia is 2.2 kilometers. The beginning is a difficult stretch that includes a very steep stretch of stone stairs. Luckily for us, the weather wasn't so hot. It was very pleasurable for us, so we were very, very lucky. But once you reach the top, you will be treated by a beautiful bird eye view. At Cornelia, we stopped for a granita. There is no rush, so just enjoy the moment, be present. From Cornelia to Vernazza is 4.1 kilometers. This is where things started getting more difficult. There is a good amount of climbing and descending. From Daf pathway to Monte Rosso cost 7 euro 50 cent. I know it is very annoying. We were also upset, but you know, there is nothing you can we can do about it. And we stopped at Vernazza to get some pictures. Remember guys, bring a bottle of water with you. You can refill it in all the cities. So it's very important to remain super, super hydrated. The Sentiero Rosso takes roughly 9 to 12 hours to complete it from Porto Venere to Levanto. And Sentiero Azzurro is just 6 to 8 hours to complete all the 5 Cinque Terres. From Vernazza to Monte Rosso is 3.7 kilometers guys get ready for a difficult stretch of steep stairs following by a picturesque garden sea and beach view 
The best part is ending at the beach. Finally, we made it. So, it took us six hours to complete the Sentiero Azzurro. But if you know, if, but if you want, guys, you can do it at the opposite side. You can start from Monte Rosso to Rio Maggiore. We started from Rio Maggiore because the beginning was easier, so it helps you to get full immersion in it so you know that the vibe that you are going through you are going against or you are going through i don't know how to explain it hope you enjoy this video and if you really like it please give a big thumbs up thank you for your time thank you for watching and remember to subscribe for more videos like this see you bye